We noticed this gap between students needing knowledge in data science, but students not majoring in data science and so not getting that knowledge. And with all the problems there are, there's not enough time in your schedule, students don't necessarily know that they need this knowledge. And so that's why we created this project. DIFFUSE stands for Data Science Infused into Undergraduate STEM Education. Data science can be a major at many institutions or a minor, so you can add on a number of classes to what you're already studying. What we're doing though is we're integrating data science into already existing courses so that students don't need to take additional coursework in order to get the expertise. We try to whet their appetite with these modules. We're not creating data science experts with a little module, but we're trying to whet their appetite early on in their studies so that then they might pivot and choose a few extra classes. As a student myself, I was first exposed to Diffuse's modules in my Psych 1 class. Seeing that module definitely like transformed my, my majors and got me into majoring as a QSS major, so a quantitative social science major, and um, learning how to use data science in social science and connecting the two. Many instructors want to do this type of work. They have a lot of interest in bringing this into the classroom and to engaging their students with data science and data science skills. But doing that work takes a lot of time. So the teams that we put together uh, with the project basically allow the instructor to focus on the, the discipline-specific pieces, the expertise that they bring to that. And then the team can do all of the other work um, to help bring uh, that vision to fruition. One of the topics we study in my environmental engineering class is air quality and air quality control techniques. The, through the module that we created, students were given 100,000 data points with air quality and weather data and asked to make meaning of that. Imagine that, that's like millions of data points per student. By the end of the module, students were able to do just that. And the module empowered me as the instructor to teach students the skills to analyze that data. Well, so we were taxed at uh, analyzing air pollution in a specific area. With that data, uh, we were able to see the speed, the direction, the concentration of our pollutants. In our area, we had a lot of um, highways, and so it told us you know, what highways are contributing the most to NOx in that area. This project was really rewarding because we were given many different tool sets and different types of plots and ways to look at the data and that really helped to establish in my mind that you use this large data set and these tools to arrive at a new conclusion and to develop your own answer to it. The big piece of the Diffuse project is this experiential learning aspect. In an internship or in a project in the Dolly Lab, a partner has specific needs. They have a deadline, they have uh, limitations about how big something could be. Whatever it is, it gives a student a chance to really understand how, how the world works and then apply what they're learning in the classroom to that. Our partner at Smart Microscope is Dr. Sriharan. He is a dermatopathologist at Dartmouth Hitchcock Medical Center, and he basically diagnoses different forms of cancer by looking at skin samples. Data science on the Smart Microscope project is a huge portion of the project. We are basically building an ecosystem around digital pathology, and part of that is developing our own models. We've built a platform that mimics a traditional microscope, but lets you view digital versions of skin samples so that you can use AI models and you can collaborate, and it really simulates the look and feel of a traditional microscope, but allows a pathologist to view digital slides at the same speed that they would with a traditional microscope. The students didn't know anything about pathology. They work with domain experts and they become knowledgeable about a field in order to help build a tool to help people in that field. Those kinds of challenges are really great for a student. It, they love it because it's meaningful to them. They love to help. They love to be involved in something that has meaning in the world. And experiential learning is one of those ways that they get to do that. We care deeply about education here at Dartmouth, about teaching and learning. And this project really enhances how students enter the job market. 
the world is full of data, more and more each day, and students need to be able to make sense and meaning of all that data, regardless of their chosen field of study, regardless where they end up.